big appeal. Big, big appeal from Bumra. He's picking it up. He's picking it up. And he's gone straight away. Virat Kohli, we're having a look upstairs. Invited to director, we have a player review for LBW. Original decision is not out. It's a fair delivery. We can move on to front on spin vision, please. Okay, we need to see Ultra Edge when available, thank you. Keep that rolling through, please. Keep it rolling through. Keep it rolling through. Thank you. Keep it rolling through all the way to the pack. We've got a clear gap between bat and ball. No bat involved. Ball tracking when ready, please. Yeah. Pitching in line, impact in line, and hitting the wickets. I'm going to go back to Richard on field. Change of decision. Well, the brilliance of Bumrah. Just softening Ollie Robinson up with a short ball. And then it was a slightly slower ball. Question for Richard Lillingworth, did it pitch in line? You bet it did. Bumra went straight up and Virat Kohli said, yeah, it is absolutely dead. And he reviews straight away. Good decision. England now eight down. Well, his long vigil is over nine from 35 balls. England now 120 for eight. Right, Mark Wood, he'd have been pacing around the dressing room for the last half an hour, hour or so. He's out there with Josh Butler. It may be now that Josh Butler has to have a think about trying to protect Mark Wood from the strike. Have a look at the release here from Umra. It's a slow ball and he rolled his fingers across the ball. You could see the seam rotating as it went down. But it's also excellent control to make sure that you get the ball pitching in line with the stumps. And because it's almost like a cutter, it didn't continue straight across the batsman. It straightened a fraction. That's brilliant bowling. Absolutely brilliant bowling. What an over. 120 for eight now. So, Josh Butler has to think now how he's going to try and control and manoeuvre the strike. It's been Virat Kohli throughout the day. Very animated. Had lots and lots to say. But Bumrah has been pretty quiet in the series so far. But is he going to have the final say? Still nine overs still to go. And finally, time has elapsed, so Siraj can now come back into the attack. So Ishan Sharma bowled the last over. Now it's Siraj, who's been so impressive in this game. Four wickets in the first innings. Well, I'll be interested to see what he does, but most cases like this, Butler will try, if he can, to play out the first three or four deliveries. Oh, going down. And then if he can, try and farm the strike. At the start of the next over, that perhaps will give him something to think about. Well, DK said it earlier on. Seems as if every time India take a wicket, they take another one quite quickly after that. Just outside the line of all stump, short of a length. And people will say perhaps he had been leaving balls like that before. He could have left that one. Not this time. Virat Kohli knows it's almost over. One to go, but he knows how close they are. Butler, 25 off all of 96 deliveries, but his sojourn also comes to an end. Well, what a change. What a change. What a reaction as well from Virat Kohli. He may have dropped Butler when there were still 33 and a half overs to go. But uh, he will now feel a whole lot better.
Siraj has been so, so good in the